ಕಲಾ ನಿಲಯದಲ್ಲಿ ಆನ್ಲೈನ್ ಕೋರ್ಸ್ಗಳು ಪ್ರಾರಂಭ I welcome the students of 2023-24 July cycle both undergraduate and postgraduate students for the induction program organized by the university this induction program is organized to give a brief note about the department and the functioning of the department the department offers two programs that is under undergraduate that is bsc program and uh, msc mathematics program so these two are the programs offered from the department of mathematics the department was established in the year 2010 and it has been functioning from past 13 years we were under non cbcs scheme till 2020 now from 2021 onwards we are functioning with choice based credit system mode the students of 2023-24 also belong to choice based credit system for both UG and PG programs. The students are updated with the program is like the BSc program is as such. The BSc program is for three years. The three years program is for six semester. Each semester has a paper and one practical. The theory paper is for 100 marks and practical for 50 marks. Under the theory will be 80 plus 20, 80 will be semester end exam and 20 will be the internal assessment. When it comes to practical, for 50 marks we conduct practical for BSc program in which 40 will be for the practical and remaining 10 marks will be for the assessment and the viva post. This functions throughout for all the semester. The first four semester will have single papers. When it comes to third, fifth and sixth semester, we have three papers each. So totally we have ten uh, mathematics papers. That is maths one to maths ten and practical one to practical six we have. In each semester, we conduct personal contact program in which we uh, give a brief introduction of the course and also try to cover up as much as syllabus possible and update the students about the papers that we have and also we give a brief idea about the course and which helps the students to take up the exam. So from the exam point of view, we conduct the classes and make the students understand the concept and make them confident to face the exam. So this is the purpose of conducting classes, online classes. We do online classes under KSOU academic platform. Practical classes will be held only in the Mysore campus um, that is Karnataka State Open University Mysore campus. This class will be for 12 hours and since the students opt for three uh, major courses say PCM then 12 for three papers so 12 into 3 will be 36 hours will be for the practical classes and all the three practical classes will be held in Mysore Centre. And attending uh, practical is compulsory and uh, we request students to uh, attend the practical class without fail. Now moving on to MSc program. MSc program is also under choice based credit system. It is a two year program, four semesters. And the first semester we have uh, uh, five papers that is uh, discipline specific core one two and three that is algebra one real analysis one and complex analysis one which will be for four credits and discipline specific elective that is uh, the two papers will be ordinary differential equation and numerical analysis which will be for credit three and we have one interdisciplinary elective that, that is, is offered from the Department of Mathematics and the paper is Fundamental of Mathematics. Those who opt our elective will be taking up this exam for 50 marks. The other courses that I mentioned earlier will be 100 marks and each paper will be for 100 marks. Totally it will be 500 plus 50, 550 will be the total marks for the first semester. And total credit of first semester is 20 credits. And uh, uh, out of 100 marks, 80 will be the semester end exam and 20 marks will be for the internal assessment. 
continuing the same with second semester, we have mm -hmm. uh, five, five papers, papers, that is hardcore and softcore, which is also considered as discipline-specific core and discipline-specific elective. The three discipline-specific core are Algebra 2, Real yeah. Analysis 2, Complex Analysis 2. When it comes to discipline-specific elective, we have uh, the papers, Partial Differential Equation and Discrete Mathematics. When coming on to the open elective, we have ELMM02, that is Combinatorics and Graph Theory. So if the uh, student opts for uh, open elective uh, from the Department of Mathematics, student studies, Combinatorics and Graph Theory in second semester. So this, com uh, this is uh, with respect to the first year. When moving on to the second year, that is the third semester, we have discipline specific core, core papers, papers 1, 2 and 3 as linear algebra, topology 1 and functional analysis which will be for 4 credits and we have and discipline specific elective. We are going to offer, uh, provide, provide 3 papers and from which the students can opt any 2 papers. So the, the three papers, papers offered from the department is number theory, Q series and theory of partition and mathematical statistics, which will be for three credits. Students interested with any of these three, three papers can opt, uh, up, uh, can opt the paper which they are comfortable with and which in which they are interested. So there are three options out of which students will be opting any two. We have skill enhancements course for the MSc students of third semester, that is MMSEC1, which will be fuzzy mathematics for 50 marks. And mm -hmm. the earlier five papers which you are opting will be for 100 marks, 80 plus 20, and the scheme remains same. So overall for credit for third semester is also 20 credits. And moving on to the fourth semester, we have uh, discipline specific core three papers, discipline specific elective three papers in which you are going to opt any two. The core paper, paper will be measure and integration, topology to lattice, lattice theory. Moving on to the discipline specific elective, we have the three papers that is graph theory, operation research, differential geometry, which will be for three credits and you can opt any two paper of your interest. And we have, have one skill enhancement course, course uh, that is MMSEC2, which is um, algorithms, algorithms and computation, which will be for two credits and total credits will be 20 for the fourth semester. Overall, the total credit for MSc program is 80, okay? And, and um, we have uh, create, we usually create WhatsApp group for the students uh, if the number of st uh, students strength, if it's uh, less than, than 250, we can opt for WhatsApp group. If it crosses, crosses, then we are going to opt for Telegram group. So for BSc students, we are uh, uh, going to create a WhatsApp group and for MSc students, we will be creating a Telegram, Telegram group and the uh, group link will be soon shared to you all through the regular messages and you all please uh, join to the mentioned group. So that from the group, you can get all the updates of the department, say the classes, exams, assignments, exam notification, and uh, so on. So now, oh. assignment uh, will be uploaded in KSOU academic platform, in which uh, the student has to access the assignment uh, questions from the platform, as well as upload the same, I mean, the ans answers uh, to the uh, academ KSU academic platform by, by converting, converting the uh, answers that what, what the students write, you must uh, take up the PDF uh, form and upload it in the KSU, KSU academic platform. So the assignment what you write must be uploaded in the platform and, and you must convert that to PDF and then upload, okay? So even the study material will be available in the platform which you can download and take the print until you all get the study material. So the contact program for uh, uh, MSc uh, program is for 10 days. Okay, we do conduct the classes online through using KSU academic platform. We also prefer to conduct classes offline. Uh, it, uh, we may ask you all to uh, come to the Mysore campus or else one or two other centers will be identified and the classes may uh, be held there also. Okay, so 
yeah, we have five, five papers. Pa Each paper will be for 10 hours and it will be 50 hours of contact classes which will be done, uh, conducted uh, in each semester. And uh, uh -huh. uh, we are two faculties, that is myself, Dr. Pavitra, and uh, the other faculty is Dr. Nandesh Kesi. We both handle the various papers in the department, offered from the department. Apart from that, we also uh, take help of the other specialized uh, uh, professors, lecturers from the various universities who are specialized or uh, well versed in the field and such that you take the benefits uh, from them and uh, uh, I mean uh, they, they provide, provide you their knowledge and uh, give you all the inputs so uh, how to prepare for the exam and also you will be able to understand most of the concepts that are there in our study material which will help you to uh, do your the self study by uh, after attending the classes you will be more confident to face, face the, the exam hence uh, uh, we will train up in such a manner that you will be confident enough to take up the exam without any fear okay this is what i actually wanted to tell and uh, uh, we are uh, um, i mean uh, after completing this course the students have various opp job opportunities the job opportunities that you get is you can work as uh, teachers in various uh, schools institutions also opt for colleges if you prefer to work in uh, pre-university or in degree colleges you can work as assistant professors there is opportunity in uh, research uh, labs such as ISRO, DRDO etc you can work as data scientist as a stat statistician uh, and uh, promising roles in IT field is also there for the ma students of MSc mathematics as well as BSc mathematics uh, the role that can be played uh, in IT field that as uh, such as software developer, data analyst, then data scientist, cryptographer, computer graphic engineers etc. So there are various opportunities uh, that you get after completion of this programs and hence I wish you all the best and take uh, and get all the uh, benefits uh, completing this uh, course you will get bright you will be having a bright future and hence I uh, wish you all the best and I welcome uh, you all to the co-program and uh, thanking you. Mm -hmm.